Welcome to the non-motorized watercraft inspection training video. I'm a Tahoe keeper. I clean, drain, and dry my boat and gear after every use. A little extra time helps to protect my equipment and my passion. It's become a habit, like my paddling. By watching this video and taking the short quiz that follows, you're doing your part to help stop aquatic invaders from entering Tahoe's waters. You'll also become a registered Tahoe keeper a recreationist who is trained and qualified to inspect and decontaminate their boat and gear. Aquatic Invasive Species, or AIS for short, pose a serious threat to the recreational and natural resources of the Tahoe area. These invaders spread through the transport of water and debris that can collect in cockpits and hatches, cling to outer hulls, rudders and paddles, and even hide out on your gear or fishing equipment. Why are aquatic invasive species a problem? Some aquatic plants, like Eurasian watermill foil and curly leaf pondweed, produce thick mats in nearshore areas, altering ecosystems and hindering recreation. Others, like New Zealand mud snails, reproduce quickly and negatively impact native fish and the environment. Zebra and quagga mussels cause damage to docks, boats, and water intakes and upset natural food webs by consuming large quantities of phytoplankton that other species need to survive. Zebra and quagga mussel larvae are invisible to the naked eye, and in cool environments, adults can survive out of water for approximately 30 days. Once these invasive species take hold in an environment, they are nearly impossible to remove. We are currently fighting that battle in Tahoe with invasive weeds, Asian clams, and warm water fishes, these species have taken hold in Lake Tahoe and work is ongoing to control them. We do not have quagga or zebra mussels in Lake Tahoe. If they were to establish in Lake Tahoe, we would see irreversible and devastating effects. It is imperative that we set up defenses and prevent the spread and introduction of AIS in Lake Tahoe. That's where you come in. All motorized boats are required to be inspected before launching in Lake Tahoe. Non-motorized watercraft such as kayaks, paddle boards, or inflatables can all spread AIS and users are encouraged to self-inspect for AIS before and after launching in any water body. To prevent the spread of aquatic invasive species, follow these simple steps every time. Before and after you use your watercraft, clean, drain, and dry. Clean kayaks, canoes, paddle boards, and inflatable watercraft by inspecting your boat thoroughly and removing all dirt, plant, and other material from your rudder, hull, cockpit, and gear. Wash with pressurized hot water if available, particularly when leaving an infested water body. Drain the water from your hatches, cockpits, boards, and gear on land before you leave the immediate area. Open all hatches and plugs, turn it upside down and incline it on land to drain any remaining water. Dispose of all dirt, plant and other material above the water line on dry land or in a trash can. Be aware of storm drains and gutters that may flow to streams and lakes. Watercraft should be dry for at least five days before launching in a different body of water to prevent the spread of AIS. Adding clean, drain, and dry habits to every use will take just a few extra minutes and can make all the difference in protecting your recreation experience. Remember, it's illegal to transport AIS into Lake Tahoe and violators could face significant penalties. Clean, drain, and dry every time. Above all, take special care if you launch in a mussel or mud snail infested area. If the vessel was used in contaminated areas, it should be decontaminated by one of our inspectors. Decontaminations are provided free of charge at our roadside inspection and decontamination stations. To find a station, visit TahoeBoatInspections.com. After passing the short quiz that follows this video, we will send you a certificate and a Tahoe Keeper decal. Thanks for doing your part to keep Tahoe's pristine lakes and rivers free of aquatic invaders by becoming a Tahoe Keeper.